What's going on guys? Today I'm going to take you through a doubles off close mini scheme out of the Rams playbook. Again, this is the Rams playbook. Um, double off close formation. For audibles, I go PA fly sweep, inside zone split, switch X comeback, and PA deep out. I'll also run stick if I have Howard Master or wide receiver uh, apprentice in the slot. Um, and then I'll also run this zone fake jet. And this jet sweep, both pretty good. Obviously, they set up my main play, the PA fly sweep. So I'll go over PA fly sweep first. All right, so your main thing you're going to be looking for is circle. But I like this double wear out on the backside too. Um, Cotton kind of clears out the zone, and then Gage gets wide open behind him. But again, your first read is circle. Your backside read is going to be triangle on the wheel route. All right, so circle gets clear. You're going to hit that. Easy yardage. Now, I don't know if this is going to get open right here, but it does get open in, in practice. Uh, not practice, in gameplay. You just have to know what you, what demons your opponent is running and look for it. But triangle on this wheel route gets pretty open. Or X over the top, honestly. You just got cooked this guy. All right, high ball that, lead that. Tom Brady, Tom Brady sucks, but you see it right, it gets open. Um, triangle gets clear if it's zone coverage as well. All right, clears out the zone. Easy thing behind it. Nice little check down, five yard gain. Again, it's my favorite play to run in this formation is this PA jet sweep. But you're looking for circle main, main, uh, Circle first, X if it's man coverage and you have a good tight end can get over the top of uh, the corner or linebacker whoever's on them. And then triangle, the running zone coverage behind it is a clear out route. Should be pretty open for a good game. All right, this is obviously, you know, man coverage, you hit circle. Backside, that's PS2 with a really good corner right. But again, that play gets really, really open. The users get dragged down from the jet sweep motion. Easy play. Next play is going to be this inside zone split. Um, honestly, this is my second favorite run in the game. Obviously, 0-1 trap is the best run in the game, but I think inside zone split is pretty close as well. So I run this a lot as well, too. Double team the nodes real quick, find an opening, and get some yardage. Obviously, in practice mode, they like to play everything like they're Superman, so it doesn't work too good in practice mode, but in gameplay, it does work. Um, again, inside zone split, just double team the nodes, whoever it is, and look for an opening, right? Easy yardage you can get. Yeah, in practice mode, they play like superstars, so it's not going to happen. But you'll see that in gameplay or whenever you run this play, it's a, it does a pretty good job of, you know, blocking and getting open. You know, see there in prevent, still getting sheds. But <clears throat> again, pretty good run play right there inside zone split. Next play is going to be the switch comeback. And for this, all I do is Chris Godwin on a post. Right now, man coverage obviously triangles uh, gonna get open with this inside post route. So maybe you throw Chris Godwin on a in route with the running man coverage. But this is all I do for this play. I'm gonna X right here on a quick high ball, like no, most people do. Right, quick little route, out, high ball that to the outside, nice easy game. But for the most part, what I'm looking for is Russell Gage in this slot route um, off the break on the post. Obviously, fourth even six one, they run right there. So get a shed, but again. That's why I wanted to get rid of the CPU, but who tries to come back? Go circle on a post. If you don't have a post route, you can throw him on an end, or you can drag him, whatever you want to do, All right? Drag out gets open. You can hit that. Nice little check down. But I'm looking for a Russell Gage in the slot, so I'm going to try and hit it right here if they give me enough time. I'm going to say it won't because it's practice mode. They never do. All right. Try and go right there on a the break. Easy high ball over the top. That's what you're looking for in that play. Next play is the PA deep out. This is really good for beating man coverage, right? The out route's pretty good at beating man coverage. They pick on the corner's leverage and the route running abilities on the wide receiver. The zip route beats man coverage, and then it's delayed in route um, by Mike Evans. Gets open against man as well. All right, hit the in route. That was zone, but you can see it gets in front of that outside third or quarter, whatever that was over there. Zig route beats man coverage, right? 
That's just a Simmons, a really good safety. And then last thing you're going to look for is this delayed backside dig. Wide open in the middle of the field. All right. All three really good routes. I hit them all depending on the play and what the defense is running. But again, really good stuff out of there in this formation. Doubles off close. Also, what you guys can do is, and I have gameplay of this too, this zone fake jet, after you run the jet sweep a few times, obviously your opponent's going to be like, all right, start running jet sweep again like he always does, right? You run this, right, wide open backside, and you'll see people people don't react. The CPU doesn't react to it because of the jet sweep motion. So again, all the time, it gets open. I ran this in the game a few times, right? Nobody reacts to it because they're going with the jet sweep. And you get easy yardage backside. Really good play. I don't run it a ton of times during the game. Maybe like once or twice just throw my opponent off and get some big quick yardage. But again, you can see nobody reacts to it because of jet sweep motion. And you get easy yardage all the time with it. So good play to mix in, obviously. I like it a lot. Um, I run it once or twice a game. I have a test run of it in the gameplay film, which you guys will see. Besides that, man, the last play that we're going to go over is this PA weak flood. This is your bomb play. And if you uh, remember, at a tight doubles, so everybody runs that shot fade cross, which you play where you streak the seam guy. This is kind of like that, right? You're going to streak triangle. What I'll do is smart route square and smart route circle. All right, we don't have time right here. I got to get rid of this, the CPU defense, man. All right, so again, smart route square, smart route circle, streak triangle, right? You're gonna look for square over the top. I hate, I hate having defense in this game, man. Like, I wish I would change, change practice type. There we go. All right, offense only. Just show you the setup real quick. Streak triangle, smart round square, smart round circle. You look for circle square as soon as he cuts to the outside. Free from that outside, easy touchdown. It's just like a shot fade cross out of tight doubles. Runs the exact same way. Clears out very, very nicely. You'll see in the gameplay film it does. All right, so again, smart route both. Wait for him to make his last cut. Free from outside, easy completion. One play touchdown. So again, doubles off close formation out of the Rams playbook. I like it a lot. Runs really, 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 really well. Um, obviously stick, I run a lot as well too with Howard Master, right? So for this one, it's a flood concept, right? So crosser, it's kind of like um, PA slot cross. That was popular last year in Madden, right? This is exactly PA slot cross, legit. Um, so again, you're looking for the backside dig as a last resort. You have X for a check down as a pull down route. Circle clears out and you're looking for triangle over the top. Right, PA slot cross, exact same concept, right? That's how I do my stick play whenever I run stick. Obviously you need to have slot apprentice or wide receiver apprentice in the slot for that to work. But again, a lot of good plays in here. <laughs> I love this scheme. Again, you don't need any abilities. It helps, um, but you don't need them. The only thing is I wouldn't run stick if you have no abilities. I would just, you know, maybe do this instead with stick. Maybe keep him on the end route, slant him, streak him, something like this maybe. Kind of looks funky, but, you know, that's all you can do if you don't have hard master or wide receiver running abilities. <laughs> so, if you guys like this game, if you guys are going to try it out, check it out. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, let me know if you guys already run this game. What plays you like in this? And then also, you know, in this formation, they have Bunch X and Astley, obviously, which is popular this year. Top way off, which is pretty good. They have a really good stretch right here that you can audible over to. 
bunch of tight ends good. Wide off trips, I run out of shotgun, but they have it here, obviously under center. This outside zone looks pretty good. Um, backside, maybe out for this, I would maybe like fake motion over or motion them over, pick up an extra blocker, snap that, get an extra guy up there and run it like that. But again, man, that's the scheme. If you guys like the video, let me know in the comments. Please like and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next video. Can anybody out there hear me? Hear me?